Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Rad Kutsarot and this is going to be Scorpio Sun, Scorpio Moon and Scorpio Rising weekly Tarot and Lenormand reading for September 3rd to September 9th 2018 and while I'm shuffling the cards just to fill up the time here um, should you go for a personal reading with me all that you need to know is the uh, website which is listed down below in the uh, description of this video and uh, there you will find the list of my services and as well the uh, the prices for them. So that set aside, uh, we go for the tower reading first, four card spread as usual for the week. The first card or position represents our Scorpio topic for that particular week. Then we do have the uh, core of our situation here followed by the challenges that we have to overcome for the duration of the week and the last one will be the guidance that we um, may follow here. So uh, let's see what we got. Now the, the uh, Wheel of Fortune, very broad card and in the grand scheme of things this card could play, could speak that the, your fortune is within your hands. So you now have the, uh, the wheel of your ship and it is up to you to pick up a direction, should I say that way. That is in the literal grand scheme of things. The Wheel of Fortune is about luck, it's about maybe once in a lifetime opportunity as well, but I like to see the card into a more practical way. So it's about business, it's about taking advantage of, of even the minus things that are coming in your way. Therefore, you can expect very busy uh, career uh, career week should you be a, a workaholic or that you are very devoted to your career here it does look like that you will have to take advantage of a certain openings and these opportunities these openings are uh, apart from the rest of the cards which does represent opportunities because opportunity could mean many things you know uh, for example the eight of wands are opportunities to further current projects here we do have an opportunities to start a and new projects you know or to try something new just to, so you can see is it working out for you or is it not working out for you therefore this week uh, will be quite dapple you know with different kind of uh, activities and enterprises and just with the wheel of fortune you know it's impossible to be said in which kind of a field that will take place for example you may meet someone that will uh, kind of like that you are going to enthrall and they're going to enthrall you with a an intimate interest you know um, <clears throat> As well, this card could speak that finally you uh, unblock yourself from a, a situation of how either into your career or either into your relationship. My point here, Scorpio, is that this week there will be a, a huge blo blockage dropping off from your uh, from your situations, career or relationship wise, and you have to take advantage of it and capitalize on it, and that will not happen if you slack. So I have to write this one down for myself because I like to slack a lot. I mean, I'm, I'm quite lazy. <laughs> anyway, so uh, yeah, this week laziness is something that you cannot afford because as I said, that could be as well a once in a lifetime opportunity for you. And the core of the situation here, this is going to be the hangman. And as I said, a huge blockage is dropped off. And that is the core of the situation, a blockage until this very moment. And now the time has come Come. So uh, the circumstances has now shifted and they are turning in your favor. The thing with the hangman is that um, previously in the past you couldn't do much about it, you know, because the hangman usually signifies a situation being set out and with delays. Um, and the cause for that are circumstances which are highly, highly not dependable on you. For example, you have done your job, but your partner haven't. Uh, you have done your job, but your client doesn't want to pay you because they don't have a money, you know. And whatever you do, even if you sue them, even if you win the court case, you will not get your money back until they don't have any money to pay you, you know. So these are circumstances which does not depend on you. Whatever you could have done, uh, you have done it and uh, 
afterwards only thing you have to do is to wait is to wait until this very week so you can uh, from these couple of cards i could say that you can expect a, a big resolution of a very troublesome um situation it could be regarding money you know it could be regarding your relationship as well or your job or your friendship circle for every single one of us it will be different regarding um where we are finding ourselves in our life and uh yeah that will be a, a huge drop of blockage so it's kind of like an opening as i said that you can't proceed further your time has come should i say that way uh, then uh, we do have the challenges that you have to overcome. This is the King of uh, <clears throat> the King of Cups, and uh, this card does not fit very well because the King of Cups usually is very professional person, very well timed with their emotions. So the only thing that actually makes sense here is that you can become over emotional. It will be very difficult for you to keep your emotions in check and time and the only um how can i place it the only negativity of that is that people may see you a little bit immature that you have lost your cool you know and uh, that you are not the same person as you have been before and one more thing comes into my mind right now um you may have some secrets from particular people let's say that you secretly like someone or you love someone and you don't want to tell them for whatever reason that card here sitting into a negative position makes you more um kind of like uh more um vulnerable was the word i was searching for to express your emotions uh, and that also speaks for ill feelings so let's say you don't like somebody at your job and you are keeping your cool you're keeping your professionalism until this very moment but because you are quite excited here you don't give a damn about it and you just you know say it all out and that could provoke some um you know some not difficulties exactly but let's say confrontations there so you have to be careful about that and at the end we do have uh the guidance here death card wow all right so this speaks how you should utilize and capitalize on the wheel of fortune and you got to use it to exert a, a full complete change into that field of your life so i don't know if you realize it here but depending on which field of your life this um, this event takes place you can traverse its co its course drastically on into a 180 degrees so let's say that your relationship is in a very bad shape right now and this week the blockage falls and you can recuperate it to its a hundred percent vitality now same thing goes for your career i mean your boss is almost to fire you something happened your blockage drop you make your performance and you consolidate your place there and even you can go for a promotion as well so uh, if you are feeling desperate if you're feeling hopeless for a certain situation have faith guys have faith scorpio because the hope is coming and the hope is coming this week september 3rd to september 9 2018 and as tarot points to possibilities you know uh, you need to help it. I mean that you have to be vigilant and aware enough to take the opportunity and to capitalize on it. Otherwise, it will just fly by and go with the flow and you will, and you will be left, what? Hanging so uh yeah that was the tarot reading let's uh, i'm very curious about the lenormand i think that or you know i hope that they're at least gonna show us where this is going to happen or at least how uh, this opportunity is going to start emerging so we can be uh, more vigilant and don't miss it a second
All right, so we do have the first card, which is the stork. It could speak for a, a new beginning or delivery. Then we do have uh, the ring. That is a partnership commitment. And we do have the rider, which is a, a new era or a, a message. So that is a definitely new commitment or a new partnership. It could be love interest, all right? Or that also could be a... Um, a sign of conceiving as well all right i would like to have the child if it is about conceiving here or at least the three next to it but the ring here points to um establishing some sort of a either commitment partnership or relationship with someone new however i think that that will be someone new depending on your situation this is from where the um the change starts to happen or the opportunity arises uh, from uh, that commitment um, relationship you know or partnership so that being said Scorpio this was your weekly tarot and Lenormand reading for um, September 3rd to September 9th 2018 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and uh, again should you go for a personal reading with me uh, all that you need to know is my website listed down below in the description of this video Rod signing out now see you next time bye